Hi, my name is Nicholas Masterson with BNDAR Industrial Automation. I'd like to tell you a little bit about our new technology called MAP Technology. So MAP, which stands for Modular Applications, is something new we brought to the market to help OEMs decrease their time to market for their machine by up to 67%. MAP Technology is based on MAP components. Each one of these is a standardized, easy to use function block that can be added into your machine application. They have a consistent look and feel because they are created by, maintained by, and supported by BNR. This allows us to provide worldwide support by BNR for this application. Map technology is based on map components, which handle the base functionality of a machine. Things like file management, user management, and recipe management are all things that every machine needs, but we don't want the OEM to have to focus on that part. We want the OEM to focus on what makes their machine unique to them. So we provided these standardized modules they can add to their application. These modules can be expanded with additional libraries if they need additional functionality. And some of these modules, for instance file management, include a component for the user interface so it can quickly be added to the visualization. Specific industries have unique challenges and MAP technology allows machine builders to address these. For example, in packaging, adding PackML functionality has never been easier. With MAP PackML, we've created an easy to use interface that allows this functionality to be added to any machine. Another example is MAP Robotics, which builds on the base functionality of other MAP components, such as a single axis of movement, and allows higher functionality, but with a simplified interface. Part of every MAP component is a visualized diagnostics interface. The project hierarchy can be viewed, showing the relationship between different MAP components and every MAP component that's used inside the project. This allows anyone to view a MAP component at the function block level. We can see current commands, status information, as well as the parameters used in each function block. All this is available through a web interface, which means you don't need any special software to view it.